So last race was a disaster itself. But wait, 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 wait. It doesn't end there. After the race, after investigation, many post-race penalties were given to the drivers, including Sebastian Vettel and Yuki Tsunoda, who were disqualified from the race because they were failed to provide the minimum fuel sample required. And also, you know, the winner, Max Verstappen, also received a penalty. I mean, that actually totally jumbled up the finishing order. So, after jumbling up, you won't believe who actually made it to the top. It's Guan Yu Zhou from China who able to keep his nose clean and managed to keep his car in a perfect position where everybody got penalty and he managed to get it. Guan Yu Zhou won the Spanish GP. Wow, crazy, isn't it? Yes, boys! Come on! Come on, guys! The cane, the first. I lost myself a little bit because I was like, I couldn't speak a word because I sat in tears. It sounds pretty crazy to be the first one of my count. <laughs> Yeah, huge reward for us and uh, it's uh, a day that I never will forget in my whole time. The performance of the car looked really strong, but you yourself pulled up a string of overtake. So, here we go guys, we are in the quali in Monaco and you can see it's raining. Pretty heavy lead seems like. Yes. The forecast also says that the whole weekend would be rainy, so a thing. And also, your know, last race, Guan Yu Zhou actually able to keep it clean and won the race, but everybody got penalty, you know. They managed to do that. That is really crazy indeed. He managed to place his car perfectly. So, yeah. So. Also the fact that our DNF still is our DNF last race, we had a double DNF. So we have the full courage to bounce back. Let's put the lap in and I think I should go on the wet tires as I think this is raining too much. Gonna be a difficult, you know, difficult thing right now because you can see this is our first outing I guess in the rain. So this is gonna be a bit difficult, maybe, I don't know, let's see what we can manage in rain. A lot of actually water. So I meet you in the starting of our quali lab. So we're gonna start our quali lab, you know there is no DRS available in rain, only ERS, so starting our quali lab in 3, 2, 1, go. Full focus. Quali in rain. Let's go. Come on, 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 come on. Woohoo! We set the fastest lap. There we go. We are back on pole position. Yes. Also, Mick in P4, just just behind Leclerc is home race. Leclerc's home race. So let's head on to the race. Of course. 
Here we go, we are on the grid, you can see our engineer is uh, getting real wet <laughs> But we will still maintain our focus and will give our best Let's go, let's get it this time Pilots are going to on, ERS yes, on Let's give it a sign And we go green in Monaco with a full wet Right, someone is trying to get it, but we have the ins inside line secure and we will maintain the lead. Okay, okay, okay. Full ERS deployed. We have to maintain it. We have to maintain it. You can see a lot of water also. Also getting a little difficult to see. Someone is coming back. That is Max Verstappen overtook me. I lost the lead. Little bit. Let's try to get it back, but we don't have any ERS. Save ERS, save ERS, Lewis Hamilton in P3. Max Verstappen actually overtook me. But we'll try to get it back. Let's see, can we do it? We're gaining on Max Verstappen, but we're on the outside, Max Verstappen! Give it a, gave me a little bit of touch. I was trying to do it round the outside, but it didn't happen. Max Verstappen tried to squeeze me, but that resulted in a little bit of contact. Okay, 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 ERS. Whatever ERS I got. Let's get it. Let's get Max Verstappen. And we got it back. Max Verstappen is been overtaken by us. That is really good. Oh no, why Mick, Mick is at the last? Sadly, Carlos Sainz from Ferrari is out. No idea what happened. Maybe something happened with Mick. But Mick is in last position. And Carlos Sainz in Ferrari, the Spaniard, is out. Oh, that was a bit of a, you know, touch with Max, but that was scary. I almost got into the wall, but got away with that. Max really tried to give me a squeeze, but I was really not ready for that. Max is really aggressive driver, even in the rain. He's like planning for the aggressive moves out there. But we have to be, you know, always focused because this is Monco plus rain. Monco plus rain. Woohoo! We set the fastest lap, that is a good thing. Now we have to save the ERS as much as we can. Esteban Ocon is out, I don't know what happened. Maybe hit the wall because the conditions are like that. Very difficult out there. Grip conditions are changing constantly. And the street circuit plus rain. Very difficult to get the car. Sadly, Mick is at the back. Look at the water spraying on our screen. It's difficult to see, really. Look at the water. But we are trying our best to get whatever we can, and we are also saving ERS. We hold the fastest lap, so nothing to worry about the fastest lap. We have to maintain it because Monaco is all about patience and the rhythm you know when you get into the rhythm so i gotta do it consistently driving in a consistent place around monaco it's never easy it's always the something different out here in monaco but now it's raining so yes Ooh. our tires are a bit worn out but you know the wet rules in wet race, there is nothing like no compulsory pit stop. You can pit stop if you want. If your tires are just give up hope. But there is nothing like compulsory. Like in dry race, there is compulsory one pit stop. At least you have to do a pit stop. But in wet, that rule does not apply. Also in wet, you don't get DRS, only ERS. So ERS saving is very much needed. I'm driving extra carefully. We have secured the fastest lap, Lewis Hamilton is in Alonso, wow. Guan Yu Zhou, the confidence boosted guy. Now on this lap, we will use a bit of an ERS. No mistakes, please. It's going good. Our team need to score good point because we are literally fighting with a top historical team that is Ferrari so I have to be elbows out we are a new team 
and already started fighting with the big team so yes a lot of stress also with all the stuff going on around so let's see what happens whether the track gets dry or not whether the rain stops or not but as far as in, uh, current forecast i don't think the rain will stop it's still very wet So Ricardo, Dan and Ricardo actually decided to pit. Maybe he was facing tire issue. He actually started on inters. So that's a strategy. He opted for I started on full weight. And I think the full weight working better. And we are already facing some lap cards. That is Nicolas Latipi. We will quickly overtake him. In blue flag condition good vsc something happened maybe out of the pits i because i saw i saw i surely saw daniel ricardo and yuki sonoda luisa under vsc but we already crossed the pit lane you know it would have been little bit better if i had maybe you know if i had okay we are green 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 if i had new set of wet tires because this seems little bit of worn out but work this tires working good no issue with that oh bit of changing wet condition oh okay 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 I saw one car in the pit. The rain light getting helpful little bit because in this condition it's difficult to understand whether a car is in front or not. Okay, there is a car in front. Let's see who that is. There was a lap car for sure because we are in the lead. Okay, I noticed one thing with a glance. Checo. Red Bull driver Checo is actually out of the race. Another victim of Monaco plus rain. Don't know, but Checo Perez is out. So another Red Bull is out. Lewis Hamilton is in second right now. You can see. So yeah, Monaco getting its victims. Okay, I am actually seeing bit of a graining in the hard tire. Uh, no, not hard tires. I mean. uh the wet tires i think do we have the gap to uh get a pit stop and come out in the position we are maintaining let's have a go let's use all our ers right now um have a pit stop i think Let's have let's get some fresh wet tires. That's a lap car. Don't be the headache. Move out of the way. Albon, it's difficult to sometimes overtake in Monaco. He's slowing down for me, but we will pit. We'll pit. Box, 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 box. New hot, new wet tires. Get out of the pit. Get out of the pit. Should be okay. Okay, okay, okay. Are we still in the lead? Max is closing up. Yaris, 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 Yaris. Get the boost. Get the boost. Woo! Louis, 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 Louis in P2. Are we safe? Yes, we are safe. We are safe. We are safe. Eight second gap. That is a good gap, to be honest. So we are on to fresh hot tires. and we are good to go let's see who actually gets his second position because there's a competition between max verstappen and oh max verstappen and louis hamilton seems quick so checo and carlos sainz both are out so one less driver for the top team of red bull and ferrari 
Russell is still there I guess yes Russell is still there in the race from Mercedes our teammate yes something happened in the first lap and which we still don't know but we'll surely know later on George Russell who is out of the point because our teammate actually managed to overtake George Russell even after that incident in the first lap where our teammate got back of the grid <laughs> managed to get George Russell and our teammate is in the points oh did you overtook Norris did I just saw that oh BSC oh no Luis Max Luis Max Luis and Max what happened what happened they're fight maybe maybe they're fighting resulted in a crash I don't know I don't know what happened but both are out oh my god oh my oh my dear oh my dear Gohan you show isn't it Alonso is in second oh dear we are now in green condition but oh dear what happened there what happened what could have happened probably they crashed probably they crashed with each other fighting too hard Max and Luis being in second and third are actually out oh Joe decided to pit which gives his teammate Bottas no actually Bottas also pit it feels like it was jumbling up position because they are changing on to newer wet tires Joe's on wet tires okay come on come on come on battle is in the points lap cars have to be careful overtaking lap car Sebastian Vettel blue flag blue flag it feels kind of odd to say Vettel the blue flag song but that's how time has changed yes you do Joe actually drop out to P4 but that's still a very great position Valtteri Bottas actually Alfa Romeo's podium, Alfa Romeo's win, Alfa Romeo's podium, Alfa Romeo is like Woo 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 Oh did Guan Yu Zhou overtook his teammate, experienced teammate Maybe Blue flag, that is our teammate Thank you Mick, you've been the best teammate I ever could have wished for Thank you Mick Mick is right now more than a driver, he's like our family member right now in the team. So, great relation with Mick as a driver, as a good friend, as a good teammate. Oof. Our pairing is, I feel very nice about Mick. But right now, we are on our penultimate lap. Let's get it done because Monaco is really one of the tiring race it feels like a lot of lap cars lap car Latifi lapped second time <laughs> lapped twice at the same time I mean lapped by lapped by those car in front Pierre Gasly we are getting closer blue flags are shown but we are not trying to overtake him let's be smart and we'll finish like let's overtake him he gave out the way and here we go Mongo baby yeah. okay Guan Yu Zhou sadly Valtteri Bottas got him at the end but Guan Yu Zhou Still fighting. Oh, Guan Yu overtook his teammate. Guan Yu overtook his teammate. <laughs> teammate battle for the podium. Guan Yu is full of confidence. Full of confidence. And look at Mick. Where Mick actually managed to get it. 
Go on, new show. Come on, dude. Come on, new show. Let's see what can we can go on, new show. Get the podium. Get the podium to prove everyone that he is capable. He is able. He is the driver. He is the one. Go on, new show. Get it. Leclerc gets all the reporters. Oh, Leclerc gets P4 in his home race. That's Mick Schumacher. I'll still clap for him because he did a he bounced back from what happened in first lap. He recovered. Uh, he recovered from what happened. Max Verstappen, Lewis Hamilton, Checo Perez, Daniel Ricciardo, Yuki Tsunoda, Esteban Ocon, and Carlos. Uh, yes, Carlos Sainz are all out. Vettel actually scores point. after his disqualification because he was uh, unable to you know provide the minimum fuel sample required and if they are able to not able to provide it then it's a, no mercy it's straight out disqualification sadly uh, lance stroll and nicolas latifi two canadians scored point last time after this you know penalties but this time they gonna miss out on scoring point wow guan yu jo dude Guan Yu Zhou, I'm happy for Guan Yu Zhou. I'm happy for Mick, also our teammate. How thankful I can be of him. He pulled it out after the incident. That is cool. We gave it our best. We gave it our best. We won the race. Alonso is in P2. Guan Yu Zhou P3 with the home hero Leclerc is in P4 with Valtteri Bottas in P5. We won the race. We won the race. Yeah, on the back from what happened. Yes. Yes. You 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 yeah. Straight out 26 point with the fastest lap. What can we say? What can we say? Nice. Nice. Quan Yu Zhou is like really confidence boosted. <laughs> Another great perform. Great. Like from Alfa Romeo team another you know podium finish Guan Yu Zhou great and there is the final you know Leclerc we are in 113 Leclerc 96 the championship fight is not over let's get it we have to catch Ferrari we have to get Ferrari we have to get Ferrari our team with mix P7 up the incident strengthen up the things we'll meet you next time Stay happy. We won again. Yes. We had another chance. I would never let you steal my plans. Bring me back to life. If we had another chance. Yeah.